my kitchen today I will make baked donuts for breakfast so don't go stay here a little bit I will give you some super fluffy, moist and delicious with my favorite topping you can pick the topping but I choose my topping today okay let's get start set the milk first and I need one cup of whole milk oh my gosh milk is almost all over and next I will break one egg okay one egg in good with two tablespoon melt butter, I use a uh, unsalted butter. Two tablespoon melt butter in. Good. Okay, I whip it well. Milk, egg, butter. Done. We need add one cup of flour. Put to the colander here. And next, I will add one teaspoon, five teaspoon baking powder one one half teaspoon ground cinnamon one eighth teaspoon ground nutmeg one fourth teaspoon salt perfect that is and now you sip the flour with all spice you add for sugar today i will use one third cup of sugar with medium sweet not too not too super sweet but you like super sweet and you like Let's add to what you like. But for me, I like medium sweet. I am not sweet in generous. <laughs> okay, one third cup of sugar in. Just mixing all the ingredients together. Well, like that. Oh my gosh, what I'm doing today is so messy. <laughs> Sometimes messy a little bit in the kitchen. So slowly pour, mixing milk, eggs, and butter. And slowly wish well finish one important part I have to do it put it back here I will tell you why I have to do it okay mix one more time but if I finish now I will need the how can you make a donut without donut tray here I have a mini donut tray perfect size for my family Spray it with vegetable oil, like that, so that doesn't get sick. Perfect. And now, pour the butter in the donut tray like that. You don't want to pour it full, you want to pour it two and third. So now put in the oven at 350 degrees, about slightly 15 or 17 minutes. You will check the donut. Donuts is over now, so almost finished. So I'm going to make my favorite topping. You can pick your own topping you like, like cinnamon with sugar, or powdered sugar, or chocolate, or uh, icing. Uh, but I pick my own today. Salty caramel topping, absolutely amazing. Okay, to make salty caramel, I will need white sugar, one fourth cup of white sugar, not too much sugar because I'm afraid of getting small so one fourth cup of white sugar that's enough for me yeah, I will check the donuts cook or not oh, come clean okay, good it means my donuts cooked take it the right way and steam here you are donut Upside down the tray. Let it go. Okay, let it cool a little bit. I have to do check on my caramel. Caramel is getting burned really quick, so you have to really quick and see. Gets a beautiful color now. I will add a little bit of butter in the caramel. One toast stick of the butter. Let the butter melt and slowly I will add the heavy cream or cream you have. I will add cream, that's about two tablespoons of cream. And I will add one eighth teaspoon salt. It's salty because it is a salt caramel. So now take the rest of the that's it. 
So okay, donuts after baking the oven about 80 minutes with my oven, but I think the oven may be faster around 50 minutes or 70 minutes. And then you see, it looks absolutely amazing. The color is beautiful. You see it. And I already made my favorite topping, salt caramel topping. But you like the topping, choose whatever you want, like powder sugar or cinnamon with sugar or chocolate. But for me, today is salty caramel.